Hi everyone, today I have three fun things to share with you. I am going to go over the beauty box from Look Fantastic for July, the glossy box, and a challenge that I have created for myself. I'll start with the challenge. There will be time stamps down at the bottom so you can get to the glossy box or the look fantastic box. So the challenge I have put up on myself is to do 30 days of postings. I did that because I kind of slowed down during the summer. We went on fun vacations and I wanted to kind of catch up. But also, because these boxes are July boxes and I didn't get them done until now, so this video will be out on August 1st, I want to show each product individually on a daily basis for the next 30 days because all of the products, at least most of the products, well, all the products I'll be able to use here in Texas and warmer climates, but all of the products appear to be almost like a transition from summer into fall. The colors or the level of hydration steps up a little bit. So can't wait to show them all. At the end of every video, I will guide you to the next one that will be coming up the following day. So I hope you join me on this journey. I will post it between 11 and 1. I have to kill myself to film it, edit it, and post it. We'll see how I do. All right. Hope you guys enjoy the look here. I was inspired by the algae growing on rocks at the river. So even my makeup, my nail polish, my shirt, beautiful peacock feathers. Okay, so let's start with Look Fantastic. Look Fantastic um, has sent me different boxes before, but they actually have a beauty box. They're from the UK and this got shipped directly from Great Britain. Here's the box. This one for July came in a cute little self-contained box. See, it says, um, it says beauty box look fantastic. So it's a monthly subscription. I think I just got a three month trial and the cost was $17.32. Looks awfully low. So I might have gotten the 12 month subscription. I will run the cost of the box right here. And if I have either a group code, a code or just some promotion that they're having right now, I will put that link in the description for you. So what came in this box? First of all, I love, it's obviously fake leather, but I love the color of it. It's an off-white with a transparent top so you can immediately see what's in it. There were six products and here it says beauty box edit wonderlust a strong desire to travel discover learn inspire it's quite thick there are 18 19 pages with several things it starts with the editor's notes and describing the product so what i'll try to do is follow the products just quickly because i will go over each one of these independently next week. So we're gonna start with the Revlon Classic Super Lustrous Lipstick in Rose Wine. So I thought this color was beautiful. Here it is. And it's just a Revlon lipstick in a shade that I would know to pick. I am very tanned right now. And this is how the color shows. I will go into detail and under different lighting next week for you guys. The next product is a Illa Masca Beyond Liquid Mini Highlighter. And it is mini, <laughs> super tiny, but um, I did try this on. I'm actually wearing it. It's pretty, it has a golden peach color to it. And again, I will review this further for you in the upcoming days. The third product is the Star Skin. So I'm very curious about this one. Star Skin VIP 7 Second Luxury All Day Mask. Can't wait to try it. So whatever it does, it does 
seven things. Seven in one Miracle Skin Mask Pads. Ooh, it's little pads, so I guess you exfoliate. We'll see. The next product is a brand that I know is very well known in Europe and some of my YouTube friends are always raving that this is like one of the best brands. It's called Elemis and it's Superfood Glow Priming Moisturizer. So cool. Moisturizer maybe you put it on before you put your makeup on and make your glass skin look. Looking forward to that one. We'll try it. The next item is a cucumber soothe and moisturize hydrating gradual glow so face and body tan mist so this is a tan mist that will eventually get you tanned but a little bit at a time Oof, i'm very cautious about this but we'll try the next item is a I really need my glasses. I think this one is for your hair and it looks like a full-size product. It's called Grow Gorgeous Intelligent Hair Care Defense Anti-Pollution Leave-In Spray. Ooh, I love those. Fantastic. So I can't wait to learn a little bit more about that one. That is it for the Look Fantastic box. So come along with me. I will start actually with the products on um, these products for the next six days. I hope I can do it because my kid is my kids are going back to get their braces. So we have multiple steps in between that. You know, I have my annual checkups and all the school meetups before school starts. This is gonna be a crazy week, but I think I can do it. We'll see. All right, and for the glossy box. So the glossy box link will be in the description. And if there are any sales going on, I will put that right there as well. Has a little booklet. The theme is beauty treasures. Here are the items on the pamphlet. We actually had a substitution, but all of these items can be used throughout the year. The box was really cute, and it's kind of like a treasure box with seashells in it, and we can use that to save seashells that your children might have collected. The first item is the Batiste Volumizing Dry Shampoo, which I definitely need to put on right now because I think I put too much coconut oil on my hair. But I will test it for you tomorrow or sometime this week. They have a Pearly's Blue Lotus Seaweed Treatment. I'm looking forward to trying that one on as well. I've been using masks almost every other day during the summer. I really like the way they make my skin feel. And then there are two brushes. They're eyebrow eyeshadow brushes. A fluffy one that we will try on as well. They match my fingernails beautifully. <laughs> and then there's one that's thin. I actually use one similar to apply makeup to the under section of my eye or highlighter right here underneath your eyebrow. But we'll go over that this week as well. I did not get the golden ticket. That was one of the things. You're, if you got a golden ticket, I think there were only a handful, maybe seven or 50, I don't know how many, would get a $350 value hair straightener. Wish I had gotten that, but I already dug through here and I did not. The next item is an eye cream, which I will definitely use and go over it and explain it to you next week or in the upcoming 30 days. And the very last one is a illuminating blush in a super tiny I need to open this this was a substitution because the original was supposed to be a um, eyeshadow duo this is really cute guys can't wait to play with it in the upcoming few days so 
Don't forget to join me. I will be posting these between 11 and 1 Central Time for the next 30 days. See you then.